well, we did it. You got to purchasing your decorations, you got to purchasing everything for your party. But on the next page, like after the receipt, next page, it asks you to show your work. Now, how do you do that? Remember, this is what we are, your teachers, this is what we are looking for. So I had that I'm gonna rent four tables. I looked at the decorations prices. I'm gonna need at least four tables. They're $10 a piece. So I put my quantity, rent, I wrote rent tables, and then I got $40. How did I do that? Well, I wrote my stuff out by hand. I wrote it in a, in a notebook. How can I show my work to my teacher? Well, there's a couple of different ways. I'm gonna show you two different ones. I can show my work right here on, on the page. The way to do that, I'm going to select the scribble tool. And so it was four tables. And as you can see, I have to select the scribble tool every time and they are $10 a piece. And as you can see, this is taking a while. Boop and bloop. So I can show my work on there using the scribble tool, but that's taken a long time because for each line, I have to select the scribble tool again. There's not really a good way of doing this. Or if you're like me and you decided that you wanted to put your work on, uh, your work on paper, what you'll do, I have my notebook here, use your, use your phone, take a picture, and then from the picture, email it to yourself. And you're going to email it to your, yes, to your at llacslv.com to your email address at llacslv.com. When you do that, like name it something like decimals work or something, I've already done that. When you do and you go into your email, there'll be an email there from yourself and then the picture that you took. So this is the picture that I took, is math work. Click up here to add to drive. I've already done that. So now this picture of my work where it says decimals, 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 decimals is already in my drive, which makes this next part really easy. I'm gonna go, I have a couple of different ways of doing this. I can either click insert underneath in my toolbar or this little guy that looks like a picture, insert image. It gives a drop down. I'm gonna go to drive. And as you can see, everything that I have uploaded, it defaults to recent. Recent meaning the things that you, you just added are going to pop up first. I'm going to select this picture, insert, and then boom, there's my math work. Now, if I have a few different pages, if I've got more, I can resize this, move it around, and insert another image. So either upload from your, I can either upload it directly from my computer or since I already have it saved in Drive, I can select the images that I need and then it'll pop up in there and that's where it'll stay. So this, these are two different ways of showing your work so that it is all right here in your decimals project. You're gonna to have to do that for page five, page eight, and page 11. So as always, if you have any questions, please come and find me. Otherwise, good luck and happy math.